हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई सी अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड प्रॉब्लम्स ऑन हार्टले ऑसिलेटर लेट अस कंसीडर द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम हियर वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ ऑसिलेशन एंड आल्सो वी नीड टू चेक द कंडीशन फॉर ऑसिलेशन द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ ऑसिलेशन ऑफ हार्टले ऑसिलेटर कैन बी गिवन एज f is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi square root of l equivalence into c so here l equivalence can be given as l1 plus l2 plus 2m since the mutual inductance is given l equivalence is equal to l1 plus l2 plus 2m if the mutual inductance is not given at that case l equivalence will be equal to l1 plus l2 since mutual inductance is given we will consider the mutual inductance in the formula so we can say l equivalence will be equal to 750 micro henry plus 750 micro henry plus 2 times 150 micro is 300 micro henry so l equivalence will be equal to 1800 micro henry therefore the frequency of oscillation can be written as 1 divided by 2 pi square root of 1800 micro into the capacitor value is 150 picofarad so if we solve this we'll get frequency of oscillation as 306.25 kilo hertz now we need to check the condition for oscillation so condition for oscillation is that gain should be greater than l1 plus m divided by l2 plus m so this formula is used when mutual inductance is given if mutual inductance is not given at that case we can write gain should be greater than l1 divided by l2 so if we substitute the value of l1 beta and m we'll get 50 should be greater than 750 micro henry plus 150 micro divided by 750 micro henry plus 150 micro henry so if we solve this we'll get 50 should be greater than 1 so it satisfies the condition of oscillation since 50 is greater than 1 we can say it satisfies the condition of oscillation let us consider the second problem in hartle oscillator l1 value is given as 10 micro henry l2 is 10 micro henry here we need to find the value of c that is required for an oscillating frequency of 150 kilohertz so the frequency of oscillation of hartle oscillator is f is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi square root of l equivalence into c so here l equivalence is equal to l1 plus l2 since mutual inductance is not given so we can say l equivalence is equal to 10 micro henry plus 10 micro henry so it will be equal to 20 micro henry since c is inside the square root let us square both lhs and rhs so if we square both lhs and rhs we'll get f square is equal to 1 divided by 4 pi square into l equivalence into c so from this we can say c is equal to 1 divided by 4 pi square into f square into l equivalence so we know the value of frequency of oscillation and l equivalence if we substitute these two value we can find the value of c so we can write 1 divided by 4 pi square into 150 kilo square 
multiplied with 20 micro henry so the value of capacitor will be equal to 56.28 nano farad so this is about the problems on hartley oscillator hope you have understood the topic thank you